PlayStation VR is out October 13th. So let's take a look at what's in the box. So what we're looking at here is the PlayStation VR core unit. And of course, the main event is the PlayStation VR headset. PlayStation VR headset uses a high-end 1080p OLED screen specifically designed for maximum response in VR. There are integrated LEDs around the headset. Those are used for motion sensing. Then let's take a look here at the included inline remote. Now the inline remote allows you to control audio settings and also uh, mute or unmute the integrated microphone. Flip it around and we have an audio output. PlayStation VR does come with a stereo headphone, but you can bring your own Either way, this will output a 3D audio signal, which is perfect for VR. Moving on, we have the PlayStation VR processor unit. You'll use this to connect PlayStation VR to your TV and to your PS4. It also enables some cool features like 3D audio and the social screen experience, which allows other folks to watch or even participate in the PlayStation VR experience you're having. We of course have an array of cabling, HDMI cables, power cables, USB cables for connecting PlayStation VR to your PS4. And also don't forget the PlayStation VR demo disc, which comes with 18 playable demos. And there's some really awesome stuff on here. Battlezone, Until Dawn Rush of Blood, Riggs Mechanized Combat League, and a whole lot more. Absolutely must play material. That was our quick look at what's in the box for PlayStation VR. One reminder, you do need PlayStation camera to use PlayStation VR but you don't have to wait till October 13th to try it. Many retailers are offering demos. There's lots more to come to. With approximately 50 games launching by the end of 2016, the best is yet to come. So be sure to keep an eye on PlayStation Blog. PlayStation.